And with growing opportunities to apply aviation, aerospace and unmanned systems to low-altitude economic models, Vietnam's low-altitude economy is projected to reach a value of up to 10 billion U.S. dollars. And this assessment was highlighted at the Vietnam's International Low-Altitude Economy Forum 2025, held in Hanoi on November the 14th, underscoring how crucial it is for Vietnam to act early and shape its position in this emerging field. Our reporter Chang Anh has more details. This UAV is equipped with a camera that sends real-time images back to the control device as it follows a preset fly path. And that it makes it possible to monitor large areas and quickly detect any unauthorized objects entering the restricted zone. And this is just one of many standout models that showcase at the forum. Our UAV is used for aerial reconnaissance and border patrols. Currently, about 80% of components in this UAV are domestically produced. These individual breakthroughs point to a bigger shift, one that is now at the center of the Vietnam Low Altitude Economy International Forum 2025, where leaders and experts gather to chart the future of low altitude technologies. With some uh, data from the already, already exist, existing from the drone applications that must be uh, AI applications uh, are based on the big data. So in the near future, the AI applications will be uh, the critical one, I think. The forum also proposed solutions to turn the underused low-altitude airspace into a new economic zone. First, we need a firm policy commitment, beginning with a sandbox for testing. Second, a dedicated industrial zone where local and global companies can build a shared production hub. And finally, Vietnamese businesses must commit to international collaboration to expand the low-altitude market. With the low-altitude era taking shape, Vietnam is laying the groundwork to open a new direction for the country one that connects resources and accelerates the adoption of modern technologies.